Hi folks, it's Robin from Red Fez here. Just wanted to do um, a quick video just to talk about these solid state drives. Um, we've had quite a number of jobs in and a number of inquiries over the last few weeks about solid state drives. What are they? Well, basically, it's the modern take on the hard drive. The uh, traditional hard drive is full of little, if you can imagine it, DVDs stacked on top of each other that spin around with an arm that reads what's on them. So a lot of moving parts and it, they've pretty much been like that uh, since the year dot really. So it's one of those technologies that hasn't really moved on. Yes the interfaces have changed so they run a little bit faster but they've ended up being the bottleneck in your system and they can't really keep pace with the speed of modern day systems or with the demands that Windows now puts on it and modern websites and stuff like that. The result is, if you're still running a computer with a, a hard disk drive, a traditional spinning hard disk drive as your system drive, then you're going to have some performance issues. So you probably know that scenario where you come to switch your computer on and it takes ages to boot up, so you go away, make a cup of tea, come back, and hopefully it sorted itself out. That's because you're running one of the older type hard drives. Um, if you bought a cheap PC, um, it's probably got one of those in. Um, or if you bought one with say a one terabyte drive it's probably going to be a hard disk drive unless you went high end or bought one of the latest apples or something like that um, and one of the best things you can do is get it updated to one of these a solid state drive it is no joke to say you will get amazing performance back by doing that so I had a client yesterday had a laptop that was a few years old it was running really really slow you couldn't use it I mean it was almost 10 minutes booting up put an SSD in it and literally it's up and running within 20 seconds it really is that much of a performance increase so that is certainly something that you need to be thinking of doing if you're not too sure whether you're running an SSD already or an HDD just get in touch we can take a look we can advise you accordingly but it really is one of those things you need to be looking at doing it's not expensive not expensive at all um, much cheaper than you think of the sort of performance uh, gains that you're going to be looking at definitely worthwhile looking at so thank you very much for watching this video and um take care